First, in honor of Africa Day on May 25th, the African diaspora of Las Vegas celebrating this weekend in a big way. And for the first time since the pandemic, the community is welcoming to welcome to come out and hear the story of Africa and learn its culture. And as we continue to bridge the divide, we have 13 Action News reporter Alicia Patillo joining us live right now from Mountain's Edge Regional Park with the organizers behind the celebration and the importance of the day. And Alicia, the party already started out there. <laughs> it did. Can you hear the music? It sounds beautiful. The African diaspora of Las Vegas woke up with us this morning, and we are just so thankful. Good morning again. Good morning. Good morning. So tell us about the importance behind the event. When can people come? Tell us all the details that our viewers are watching right now. It's tomorrow, right? Yeah, tomorrow, 11 a.m. You're going to be a lot of fun this park. You're going to be all African people, all culture. Everybody's invited, all community. It's going to be food, fun for kids, drink. And we're going to have a lot of different dreamers from different cultures. And it's going to be a lot of fun tomorrow. Right, and we learn, we're going to learn about Africa because it's so important. Yes, uh, the reason we put together is because we want our kids to understand, everybody to understand the African culture, not what people see on the TV. So we can show the really African culture, African food, the dress, and other things about Africa. I love that. And then, uh, um, really important, Mountain's Edge Regional Park is very important to you all. Why? Uh, we choose that because a lot of community live around the area also, so you're going to have easy access to everybody and we're going to have a lot of fun on the spot. Okay, and, and then... And it's also because one of our founding members, Peter Omo, passed away of COVID uh, in August of 2020, and he was, he actually designed this park. So as African people, we're so excited to come celebrate his life and enjoy the park that he designed. I love that. And now we have a very, very special performance by I want you to say your name the, the group's name because I don't want to mess it up. Our group's name is Nandi Wantanara Multicultural Performing Arts Company. And we're a Las Vegas performing arts group here. We do African dance and drum for the community. I love it. Alright, take it away. Park. We have all the information on our website at KTNV.com. Alicia Patillo, 13 Action News. All right. Thanks, Alicia. Well